everyone, welcome to Nitin Academy and I'm Nitin. And today in PSLE Math 2022 Paper 2 Question Series, I'll be going through question 17. And this is the last question of this paper, okay? So let's get started. Okay, so today I'll be going through the question 17, which is the last question of the PSLE Math 2022 Paper 2 Question Series, okay? So let's take a look at it. So question 17 actually tests us on ratio and number times value. Okay, so uh, this question actually has three parts to it, part A, B, and C. So let's read the question first and solve part A. So Mrs. Lee baked a total of 40 large and small cakes in the ratio of 5 is to 3. Okay. So she baked a total of 40 large and small cakes in the ratio of 5 is to 3. She decorated them with cherries. The number of cherries used for each large and small cake was in the ratio of 3 is to 2. Okay? She used 204 cherries to decorate all the small cakes and 7 large cakes. Okay? So what are the remaining number of cakes? Which is basically 40. Uh, okay. We will do that later, okay? Because we don't know the number of small cakes yet, okay? So, how many cake? Uh, how many small? So for part A, they're asking us how many small cakes did Mrs. Lee bake, okay? How many small cakes did Mrs. Lee bake? Okay. So in order to do that, we know that forty large cakes are actually in the ratio of five. Uh, forty large and small cakes are in the ratio is, is five is to three. So basically, large is to small is 5 is to 3. So 5 plus 3 is actually 8 units, right? So 8 units is actually equal to 40. So 1 unit is actually 40 divided by 8, which will give us 5. So in order to find the number of small cakes baked, we're going to take a 5 times 3 because 3 units, right? 3 units is small. So 5 times 3 is actually equal to 15. So there are 15 small cakes baked. So we know that uh, 15 small cakes are baked, right? So 40 minus 15 is actually equal to 25, right? So 25 minus 7 is equal to 18. So there's actually a remainder of 18 large cakes that were not decorated with 204 cherries, okay? So for part B, they are asking us, how many cherries did Mrs. Lee use for all the small cakes? Okay, for all the small cakes. So cherries were actually used in the ratio of 3 is to 2, right? So let's take 7 times 3 and 15 times 2, okay? So 7 times 3 plus 15 times 2 gives us 21 plus 30, which is 51, okay? So 51 cherries were used to, uh, to make everything, okay? So this is actually a slight part of number times value. So we are doing this in order to find the number of groups. So basically, we're going to take 204 cherries divided by 51, which will give us the number of groups, which is 4. So now that we know that 30 cherries were actually used to decorate the small cakes, right? We can take 4 times 30. So 4 times 30 is actually equal to 120, which is the answer for part B. So uh, Mrs. Lee actually used 120 cherries to decorate all the small cakes okay so I hope you understood that so for part C next we are moving on how many more cherries did Mrs. Lee need for the remaining large cakes so there are actually 18 large cakes remaining right so let's take a look so first we are going to find the number of large cakes which is basically 40 minus 15 so we have already done that 40 minus 15 is actually equal to 25 now in order to find the remaining number of cakes we are going to take 25 minus 7 which will give us 18. Okay, next off, in order to find 7 large cakes, right, we are going to take 204 cherries minus 120 because we already know how many cherries were used to decorate the, all the small cakes. So we are going to take uh, 204 minus 120, which will give us 84. So let's find out how many cherries were used to decorate one large cake. So in order to decorate one large cake, they are taking, uh, we are taking 84 divided by 7, which will give us 12, okay? So, for one large cake, we are using 12 cherries, okay? So, 
how many large cakes are there remaining? 18, right? So in order to find 18 large cakes, we're going to take 12 times 18. So 18 large cakes is actually 12 times 18, which will give us the answer of 216. Okay? So 216 cherries were used to decorate the remaining large cakes. Okay? And I hope you understood my explanation for this question, question 17, the last question of this paper. So it, it was testing us on ratio and number times value and slightly on grouping method. Okay? So I hope you understood that. And with that, I've come to the end of this video. Thank you and bye-bye. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.